Hey YouTube, what's up everyone? Lone Starcast here, and today we're gonna be taking a look at the brand new 2024 Matchbox Collectors Mix 2 Mix. Let's get into the video. Now, I was lucky enough to find the case of these sealed. Um, I actually like them in the boxes, and that's why they're in the boxes, because the boxes make it look pretty cool, but let's get them out of the boxes, shall we? All right, now that they're all out of the boxes, let's go ahead and take a look at them closely, starting off with this one. This is a brand new casting. This is the 2021 Subaru BRZ, and yes, that is a metal base. You heard me right. Metal on metal. And this one has a new... Matchbox five spoke rear riders on it. Now, there is one con about this casting that I see, and that con is I think this casting is a little bit too small for this model. I think honestly, they should have made this casting a little bit bigger, a little bit wider, but it's Matchbox, they could do whatever they want. All right, the next car of the mix is the 1970 Toyota. Is this the 70 Toyota Celica? Yep, this is the 1974 Toyota Celica. This is probably one of my favorite color releases of this guy, too. And those are rear riders as well, too. Brand new disc rear riders, as I call them. The hood does open up on this one, which is very detailed inside on the engine. Um, I love the detail on the inside of the engine. It looks pretty cool. Sadly, this thing is being a peg warmer, which I don't think it deserves to be one because it looks very awesome. But there is the Toyota Celica. Then next up we have the, I think this is also a new model. This is the 19s, this is 1974 Buick Riviera. Or 1964 Buick Riviera, sorry my bad. And it has the lights where the lights are actually popped up. Now the special feature on this one is the doors open up on this one obviously. It's in red. Um, now a lot of these Buick Rivieras are out there nowadays because they are getting extremely hard to find in real life. But overall I think this is a really cool car. Next up we have here is another new casting. I believe it is the old, the 1970 Olds 442. And yes, that is another metal base, metal on metal. I'm so glad the Matchbox Collector sets are starting to put metal bases on some of their models. The doors do open on this one. I do love that blue color. That is not Spectraflame blue. That is a metal, metal flake baby blue color. Um, but it is a very cool casting. I actually love this casting. A lot, especially with the metal base, but it's pretty cool casting. And then last but not least, we have the Porsche Cayenne Turbo S, I think that is. And I do not like the color on this. I do not like the color on this. I do like the casting, though. I just do not like the color on it and the wheel combination on it, too. I mean, actually, the wheels are pretty decent on this one, but I just don't like the color on it. It looks pretty cool. No metal base on this one, unfortunately. All plastic with the metal body. I do love the detail on it though. They're all pretty cool. Now it's time to pick my favorite out of these five. It's definitely got to be the Olds 442 because this thing is just oof. Look how sweet this thing looks. It looks amazing, doesn't it? Like they did such a good job on it. But anyways, let me know in the comments section below which one is your favorite, and I'll see you next one. Bye bye.